Joker movie trailer review. So we can't moan today. We're going to be talking about the Joker movie trailer. So let's put on our happy faces and let's review this zombie, okay? Alright, so it kind of starts out and Joker, or this portrayal of the Joker, is a sign flippers or suppers a coin. I don't know if that's exactly what that profession's called, by the way. It's just the best word I can think of for it right now. I don't feel that great, as you can tell by how I look. So, um, I'm just going to kind of play this video by ear. Let's plan it out. Anyway, so he is a sign flipper, and all of a sudden his sign gets stolen from him by these punks, and so he tries to chase him down to get it back on his job. And they beat the crap out of him. And um, I'll be putting pictures up right here, so hopefully there's enough room right there for these images. Um, so he gets the total crap beat out of him. Right then you can tell this is going to be a different kind of Joker movie. Um, first of all, because it's focused on the Joker, not Batman. And because this is a different Joker than we've seen, even different than Heath Ledger or Jack Nicholson. It's a very different portrayal, and you can tell that right off the bat. This is kind of a much darker toned. Um, uh, when I watched the trailer, it felt that very kind of horror movie like vibe. Um, as you can tell in the picture, um, King Phoenix has lost a lot of weight to play this role, too. I mean, he looks kind of scary in the picture, and uh, um, I gotta give props to him. He is one of the hardest working actors I think out there right now. And honestly, when I heard he was gonna play the Joker, I was a little skeptical, kind of, but not as bad as I was for uh, like Jesse Eisenberg as Lex Luthor. Oh, I'm sorry, Lex Luthor Jr. Anyways, um, but I was still a little skeptical. But it, he actually does this really good, from what I can tell from the trailer. Now, granted, this is just a trailer; he can't go too much based off of that. But from what we can see in this trailer, he does seem to do what this movie is trying to do for a Joker standalone movie. Um, one of the things I like that we saw is that we got to see Arkham. Now who he is going to see Arkham in, or why he's going there, I don't know, maybe he should go and check himself in. But I like they show that because that shows that this isn't just a guy who's like the Joker we know, or Joker Jr. It is the Joker because it has Arkham Asylum, and as we all know, Arkham is in Gotham. Now where is Batman during all this? I don't know. But obviously Joker has set up a uh, set off this revolution kind of thing by standing up to the corrupt and um, government. Now how, it got, how he gets started like that into the madman Joker we all know and love, I don't know. But as you can see there's picture, um, a picture of guys in masks pushing back the cops. And then the very last picture in the trailer is him completely in his Joker outfit. And I'll put that right here. Now, from what... Uh, I saw the trailer, I really like it, I'm excited, I cannot wait to see this movie. Sorry about all the trailer reviews, by the way guys, I don't have a theater right here, not a whole lot of movies I can see, but I have themes coming up like the um, Game of Thrones unboxing and season 1-7 through seven review, so watch out for that. Um, anyways guys, go watch the trailer, I'll put the link down to the video down in the description. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I will not be giving this trailer um, a rating because this is just a trailer. Anyways, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys all next time. This is McKeon Mole, signing out. Hey guys, before you click away, don't forget I'm having a giveaway coming up. Um, be sure to leave your name, uh, why you think you should win, and you have to be a subscriber, so be sure to tell all your friends to subscribe. Um, like the video, and like I said, comment leaving your name, why you think you should win. You have to be a subscriber to win. Um, there will be three gifts. Um, prizes. Uh, very bottom will be a $15 gift card to Dairy Queen, which I already have. Second place will be Aquaman on Blu-ray. And first place is a $35 gift card to Amazon, so you guys can buy whatever you want, okay? Now, um, thank you guys for watching. Like I said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And watch out for the giveaway. I'll see you guys all next time. This is Ken Mole, signing out.